this is kind of this tradition meets a little modernism because normally this is so this is vitello tonata right yep. so, but the the vitello is like cut like thicker and what else is, is on the plate right now Mangiare, ma or I, we should say manjuma, right? Manjuma, manjuma. manjuma. Veal, I, I've always understood, wow, so but like watching the chef, tonato sauce is anchovies, which aren't from Piedmont. Tuna, not from Piedmont. Yeah. Olive oil, olive oil, not from Piedmont. Yeah. And capers. And capers. And the veal and the wine usually arrive from Piedmont. So uh, through the salt road uh, arrive these uh, different uh, material and they invent uh, this kind of dish uh, between Liguria, Sicily and Piedmont. You know? I mean, this is, de this is delicious. Because a lot of times, no offense to some people, but a lot of times the, the, uh, the Telotonat, the veal, is kind of like cardboard. It's like dried out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's super thin. thin. It's been here for a while. And you, yeah. you're like, <laughs> uh, but this, this is this is another level. Um, Complimenting to the chef. This is probably the best. Vitello, this is the best Vitello tonight I've ever had. We're having the 17 vintage, I believe, of the Gavi. Yeah. This is great, fresh, lively. And usually Gavi, uh, especially Rovereto, is a terroir that gives the most beautiful expression after one year. And they have the capacity to have a, a nice evolution for several years. Obviously, uh, the, 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 the crispy, the acidity is what gives the life to this wine and give this kind of uh, distinctive attractivity in the nose, but also in the mouth, I, I believe. Vitello Tornato, and if it's possible, not garlic. It's better, I think, no?